Hello YouTube, this is CC Pink and today I decided to make a video. I'm making it. I want to do a haul video today. This is take four on this video because I keep having interruptions. So let's hope and pray that there's no interruptions during this video and I can hurry up and just get through it. So, I already mixed up some of the stuff but I'm going to try my best to try to remember where exactly some of the stuff came from. So let's go ahead and get started with this haul. I have some fingernail polishes that I want y'all to see. Uh, this came from Big Lots. This came from Big Lots. It's a pretty eggplant, dark purple color. It is so pretty, y'all. It is called Marvelous. Marvelous. That's the name of it. And I got this pretty, um, this pretty eggshell color for $1.95 at Big Lots. And it's called Daisy Days. And I thought these two would go so good together. I got another sinful color polish from Rite Aid, which was 99 cents. And it is called Glow in the Dark. Yes, it glows in the dark. The bottle glows in the dark, actually. I have not tried any of these nail polishes, but when I get this one, I will make sure that I make a video that y'all see how this looks in the dark. Um, I got went to Kmart and in their little clearance buckets they had some nail polishes and this is a pretty new nail polish called Fashion Safari by NYC and it was 49 cents. It is a pretty new color. Also from Kmart I got this pretty mustard color and one number 153 is called Midtown Mimosa. And it's a pretty mustard color. That color was 24 cents. So I couldn't leave it. I had to take it on. It was just 24 cents. This is a pretty mint color. And it's called Minted on Broadway by NYC. It was 49 cents. It's a very pretty mint color, you guys. This one was also 49 cents. And it is called Big City Dazzle by NYC. It has pretty dark pink and blue glitter in here and that is so pretty y'all i wish y'all could see it in person now from right aid uh oh i think i i think i should have found these two brushes but if i didn't this is a blush brush and this is a contour brush that's what i'm saying i'm gonna get the stuff mixed up so okay this is a wet and wild fergie lipstick it's called bebop love see that color kind of this lipstick is called birthday suit by wet and wow mega last wet and wow and it's called birthday suit And another lipstick by NYC, which is called Violet Shine. Violet Shine. Y'all, yeah, um, I'm not going to really do any swatches because I didn't open any of this stuff before the video. But this one is called Breeze Bliss by Wet n Wild. If y'all want to see swatches of, the, of this stuff... Just comment and let me know that y'all want to see swatches with the, the hauls. But this stuff is pretty much a lot of things that are, there are already swatches on YouTube. A lot of swatches on YouTube of this, this stuff. But if you want me to do swatches on whatever I get, just let me know. You know, yeah, do swatches, include swatches in it or whatever of some of the stuff. This one is called Short Affair. A Short Affair. It's also by Wet n Wild. One of their new lipsticks in it is a pretty color. This is a NYC Sparkle Eye Dust. And I got this from Rite Aid. I don't remember the price, but it was on sale on Rite Aid. It's a, yeah, eye dust, so an eyeshadow thing. I got two pencils. I had this pencil in this pencil Turquoise by Wet n Wild. 
pretty turquoise color. Very pretty. And I got this uh, charcoal color. And that pencil is also by Wet n Wild. I also got two Jordana pencils and they came from Walgreens, I believe. Um, this one is in dark brown eyebrow pencil. And this eyeliner pencil is in brown suede. <laughs> Excuse me. I have this foundation brush by Wet n Wild that came from Walgreens. I think I showed y'all these two brushes from Big Lots. An eyeshadow brush and a concealer brush. And this lipstick right here came from Walgreens also. It's called Sandstorm. I should cut off this one I did open. But it's called Sandstorm. It's getting kind of dark in here. Sorry about the lighting, y'all. There we go. This too also came from. Okay. This too also came from Walgreens. It is a purple pencil on this side and a charcoal gray pencil on this side. And it is called Through the Storm by NYC. Through the Storm. Where is it at? Right there. Through the storm. Boom. I don't think that part went pretty fast. Okay, now the hair supply store. Went to the beauty supply store and I purchased a few things. I purchased these little eyebrow shapers, wig caps. I purchased a couple of these, but I already did my daughter's hair. So, yeah, they. Well, no. My baby girl is sporting yellow and black. Barrettes in her hair looks like a bumblebee. Yeah, because her, her nickname is Ladybug. One of her nicknames is Ladybug, but I decided to do Bumblebee because she got an aunt that just keep getting it mixed up. She keep calling her Bumblebee, so I thought yellow and black would be cute, and it was cute on her. So I'm doing my, my when I do my next daughter hair, my oldest daughter hair, I will do her in yellow and black. But I know she's getting tired of bows and barrettes because she thinks she's a big girl. She is a big girl. She is nine years old. My oldest daughter. But anyway, um, I purchased this wig from the hair store. Um, I think I paid um uh I think I paid twenty five dollars for this wig, I think. Yeah, I think I paid twenty five for it. Because I always go there and he I think it was like thirty dollars or something like that, but he gave me like I think fifteen percent off or whatever. Because I always go there. But um this wig is called Amber. And it's in the number one. It is very pretty, y'all. I'm going to do a review on this for y'all because I really like this wig. It's something like what I have on, but it's all black. And it's, you know, I, I'm going to do a review on it so y'all can see it. But it's made by sis, Sister Wig. I never had a wig by this company. And I think they are in, in connections with the Zuri makeup line or something like that. It says right here. Yeah, so that's the makeup line. But... Um, yeah, sis, sister wig. I never had a wig by this company, so I'm about to try it out. I don't know when. It says Remy Fiber. Anyway, we'll get to that in the, uh, in the review. Because I'm going to make a, uh, um, review on this wig. For y'all to see. I got some bobby pins. Rubber bands. Some eyelashes. And a concealer palette. The concealer palette was six dollars. Okay, that's it for this side. I got some stuff from the Dollar Tree. I got this little Avengers um, lunch bowl. It has three separate compartments in it: the sandwich compartment and these two. For my son. 
my baby boy and I just got him an extra little um, a sandwich part in case I want to put like pasta or something in here and I want to fix a sandwich like usually like when he get home from Head Start I just have his lunch already fixed in the freezer he doesn't take lunch because he's in Head Start but I have his lunch and stuff already packed in the refrigerator when he get home he just goes in the refrigerator and he knows his stuff is right there so I, Avengers is cute right now he has Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles so he's going to buy the new one he got I bought four packs of uh, seeds, flower seeds from the Dollar Tree. Morning Glory. Uh, I'll lose some, but they're like the uh, Verdinas. They're like those. Okay. And I got two packs of each because I'm going to put them all into the same pot with um, a big plant, like maybe in the pot with my palm tree or uh, in the big pot with my gardenia. I want to put these around that and when they grow, they're going to grow out and hang over the big pot because I'm not going to put I don't feel like putting them in a hanger basket. I think it would be so much prettier if it um, drapes down from one of my big flower pots that has a big plant in it. I just think that would be so cute. So whenever I do it and whenever it starts growing, if it grows good, these seeds usually are okay, but you have to buy a couple packs. You get four for a dollar in the Dollar Tree. They usually grow good, but you have to get a couple packs for one plant so it could turn out full, okay? But these uh, usually work. Maybe one day I'll show y'all my little mini flower yard thing. But you get four of those for a dollar at Dollar Tree. I got this book. Greatest Dad Forever, and I am going to give my husband this for uh, Father's Day. I'm going to put it in his gift bag for him for Father's Day. And I got a book that says, The Joyous Gift of Motherhood. Okay, I'm going to give that to someone for a gift for having a baby. I got a pack of Skittles, individual Skittles, because my kids sometimes take lunch. School and I like to throw them a little treat in there. I got these gummy bands. They are gummy bands to like put on your arm. Of course, I wouldn't put it on my arm. I wouldn't even eat them. But yeah, they come in these little things. And they have like bracelets, gummy candy bracelets. Yeah, so my kids seem to like them. So I guess they're good. <laughs> I got these. Shot glasses, well, dessert glasses from the Dollar Tree. You get three in the pack for a dollar. And I got two packs of these. Um, I I think they're too small for my type of dessert. Because I'm going to want more than a spoonful if I was to get a dessert. No, it, it'd probably be like a taster, like a tester or something like that. I think this glass is big enough. Well, it's a cute little appetizer. But uh, the reason I really got these glasses, y'all, they just reminded me of my church communion glasses like look how thick that is around there you know they're shorter the communion glasses are shorter but this sharp hair remind me of the communion glasses at church so I guess it's trying to tell me I need to go ahead and hurt them, you know go ahead back to church house I guess it's what God is trying to tell me this stuff start reminding me of communion and stuff like that. Like nothing come out, remind me of communion. Every time I go in the store and I see Welch's grape juice. If I drink it, it reminds me of communion. <laughs> anyway, y'all. Um this right here is a pack of of oranges. Yeah, so I put that in my kids' lunches when I fix the lunch. And I got a um, air freshener, which is called Cool Night Rain. Mm, it's all right. It's all right. It do what it do. I do it all. Yeah. I have some more stuff from Dollar Tree. I got this little purple piggy bank from the Dollar Tree. So cute, uh, I got some purple uh, 
shed paper, some purple shed paper. I got some brown balloons. Y'all got some of the stuff. I am planning someone's a someone a baby shower. And some of the stuff is what well, the stuff you about to see now is for that. So yeah. Some little booties that I got from Dollar Tree. I got some clothes pins from the Dollar Tree. We're gonna um I don't know, I might do a game or something for baby shower with clothes pins or hang up clothes pins. I got six of these candles. Purple lavender candles. And they they smell pretty good, but I don't burn Dollar Tree candles. And I have like eight of these little things that I can wrap up for favors. Yeah, I don't burn Dollar Tree candles. I just use them for decoration. Because I don't, I don't even know if they spin up or not. But they smell good in the thing. They smell like they do. I don't know. Somebody who burned Dollar Tree candles, let me know. I use them for decorations. But yeah. And some toilet tissue. That's what I got from the Dollar Tree, you guys. Now, from Walmart. Okay. Yeah. Walmart, I got some styrofoam balls. I got some streamers. Okay, I got a couple of those. I have some a couple bags of purple balloons. More styrofoam balls. And I have these little things to hang and seal in that from Walmart. Okay. I have some yarn. And I got this body wash from Walmart, y'all. I heard uh fearless team. Yeah. Yeah, that's fearless team. Talk about this body wash. She had the other one, the love. Forever is the one she had. But when I went into um, Walmart, it was all out of the Love Forever. So I just got this one. But I did smell the Love Forever in Food Lion. But it, they are so high, like $4.50 in Food Lion, almost $5 in Food Lion. So I went to Walmart and I got this for $3 and some change. But um, yeah, they didn't have the Love Forever. But that was the one I was going for. Because when I smelled it in Food Lion, y'all, that one smelled good. This one smells all right. It smells good too. But yeah, I got that because the team got it. And I just want to try it. Um, what else? Hold on, y'all. Okay. Party City. Ooh. We even got some stuff for Party City too. I got some purple tissue paper. And more streamers. Yeah, when I get the baby shower together it's not till the summer but I, I like to be ahead and start on things so I won't be so crowded when it, when the time gets here I won't have a lot to do so um yeah but when I do when we do have the baby shower I will show y'all how it turned out and how the decorations and all that turned out uh let's see what else I got to show y'all oh these shoes I went to rainbow I got some things, but I only have the shoes left here for y'all to see. I have a um, orange pair of sandals. They're orange and they have little gold, uh, little gold designs on them, metal designs. And I think they're so cute. They are so comfortable. Well, I don't know, but when I tried them on, they were comfortable. And I got the black pair with the silver metal on it, metal flowers on it. And that is so cute. I got some clothes from this for y'all, but I put them up. The sandals were two for 20. So they have a good sale on that. I went into Simply Fashion and saw these shoes, y'all. And these shoes are so pretty. They are so pretty, y'all. Look at them. They have a A on them. It looks like letters. They have letters on them. And it has, it's black sequins, y'all. And they have letters on the shoe. And I thought these shoes were so cute, y'all. Yes, they are cute. These shoes. In Simply Fashion, 
first they were $29.99 and then they were $22.97 but today I bought these shoes for $9.97 right there y'all $9.97 $10 for these pretty heels and I had to get them they were so cute I think that is it I think I did the Walmart I did all that I did the wig I did all that yes I did oh let me show y'all what I'm eating for a snack day I got some sacks I got some teriyaki wings with some french fries so that's what I'm eating today I got a banana bread earlier today from Starbucks it's pretty good. It is pretty good. It's not too sweet. It's not sweet at all, but it's not bitter. It's good. Yeah. So, um, I have a, I think I, I'm thinking about doing a, um, uh, a, a what's in my bag video. I'm thinking about doing that. I don't know. I may do it tomorrow. We'll see. But, um, yeah. That concludes my video. I think I have showed y'all everything. I got through this video without another interruption. I'm so happy. Thank you to all of my subscribers. All and new subscribers. I hope you enjoy my channel. And, like I said, if you want to see squatches of whatever I, I get, let me know. Other than that, I'll just show y'all what I got in you know, because I know it's a lot, it's a lot of ladies on here that have that do squatches and stuff like that. So yeah, um, I don't want to bore y'all because y'all already saw the color. I hope I that came out right. Y'all get it. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. Y'all, you no, know, you know what I'm trying to say. Anyway, <laughs> thanks to all of my new and old subscribers. And if you're not a subscriber, please hit the subscribe button and rate and comment. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.